tell me one thing, okay? Have you been taking your meds? Too. Fucking drunk, Megan. Oh my God. Look, I can't keep doing this, Andy. I didn't ask you to. It's my life, it's not your problem. Look at yourself, Andy. How can you say that that's not my problem? You need to go to the hospital. I fucking love that, wouldn't it? What are you talking about? You'd just be fucking ecstatic. Oh, of course, doctor. Take care of our sweet, sick little girl. We'll feed her and clothe her and drug her until she's fucking numb. And then I bet everything will just be perfect. Mom and Dad just want you to be happy. I just want you to be happy, Andy, but you keep fighting us on it. Don't repeat their bullshit, Megan. You're smarter than that. Stop it, Andy. I'm serious. Serious, too. My sweet little baby sister. Let me tell you something. You know, outside of Mom and Dad's little bubble of comforting lies, there's just this thing called reality. And that bubble pops. It'll fall. It'll fall far. Look what happens when you hit the ground. What are you doing? Megan, put the fucking phone away. Hi. Ow! Get off! Ow! Damn it, Andy! Look, I know, okay? I know that you're angry and you're tired and you're frustrated, but so are we. And you know, I know you want me to, but I'm not just gonna sit back and watch you fucking destroy yourself. I know. No, no, listen. I'm not blind. I see how much you love me. I also see the uselessness of it. You know, every time I look at you, or the doctors, or mom and dad, I, I see the same thing. Same fucking lie. I see hope. It drives me insane. I'm never gonna be okay, okay? I'm never gonna have a breakthrough and I don't want to pretend that I will. It's... I've accepted it. It's my life and I want it to be mine. And if I fucking faceplant, at least, it's me choosing to do it. I'm sorry, Maggie.